Hooley's New Home by Elaine Artemyak. Hooley's New Home. Open your eyes, little fox. It is a new day. Inside her cozy white bed, she pops out her little fluffy head. Oh, where is the snow? It must have melted, dissolved that night when Hooley the fox was sleeping tight. So begins her new adventure, off to search for her new home. After a while, the trees turn green. The blooms blossom into beautiful flowers, their color so wondrous and so is their odor. The trees are beautiful, the mud is soft, but it is still not cold, it is still not home. The river sparkles, fish are plentiful, they swim through the stream, what a beautiful spectacle, but the rocks, dirt and twigs hurt Hooley's tiny feet. Where is the snow? Where could it be? This is not home. The forest grew dark, the grass smells pleasing. It is peacefully calm, but her feet are still not freezing. The sky turns to night, the stars twinkle in the sky. The birds go to sleep and the crickets come out to chirp. Something catches her eyes, colorful, shining, big bright lights. What is that? She wonders and walks right over. There in front is a tiny town. Could this be her brand new home? The floor is hard like a stone-made field. There are tall lampposts instead of majestic trees. She creeps through the street when everyone is asleep. Warm in their comfortable beds, calm in their little heads. What is this? She wonders, looking at a large container. She pops her head in and is hit by a wondrous breeze. It is a fridge full of tasty treats. So begins her delicious cold feast. Her tummy is full, toes are cool. After today's adventure, Huli feels sleepy, so she closes her eyes and enjoys the frosty feeling. At least for tonight, this is Huli's new home.